And then time flies to 1979 when the CCP suddenly says they wanted to open and open up and reform. People are being lied and being deceived again. Because in 1989, the CCP used the tanks to crush the roll over Chinese students who are peacefully demanding democratic reforms. And then all the time, every, all the time flies to 2001. When the CCP joins the WTO, the CCP lies to the rest of the world, says that they are going to follow every of these conditions set forth by the WTO agreement. They lie to the rest of the world, saying they, they, they are going to transform China into a complete market economy. But the fact is, in 2023, even now, if any enterprise is large enough to be able to be, to be known to the rest of the world, it is impossible for it to become a private enterprise. It has to be either affiliated, owned, or being controlled by the CCP. Not only that, the CCP weaponized the United States financial apparatus to go against the United States economy.